G'day YouTube, this is just a quick overview of the latest released Linux Mint 18.2 uh, Cinnamon Desktop Edition, which is also known as Sonya, as you can see here. Now, starting off, uh, Linux Mint, of course, is uh, being a well-known and very popular distribution or version or spin-off of Ubuntu, so Debian-based distribution there. So let's get into it. So starting off with Sonya, we uh, desktop environment, of course. Now, this is the Cinnamon default desktop environment, as you can see, nice and smooth and fun, and uh, very well liked by the Linux Mint community there. There are other distros, but I won't get into those ones now, or other desktop environments. Uh, moving on, the the Windows Window Manager, which is sometimes people's concern, it's actually using the Nemo uh, uh, Window Manager there, version 3.4.5, so fairly fully functioned and fairly lightweight still uh, Window Manager, which is nice to see. Now, other things here, such as the, the kernel. So this is an interesting point of contention. The kernel is 4.8, where at the moment Linux is up to 4.10, 4.11, so it's not the latest release, but uh, I guess that does help with stability and that sort of thing as well. However, there is the option in the update manager, as you can see down the bottom right here, to actually uh, yeah, force an up update to the latest release kernel, but it's, it may be a bit buggy, so I do uh, warn you on that one there. Uh, moving on, uh, in terms of its uh, all-round uh, usability, we can see I'm just using this on a virtual machine right now, just a single core, and it's actually pretty snappy, so I'm pretty proud of that. It's uh, it's only using uh, just under 700 megabytes of uh, RAM as well, which is pretty good to see. Uh, now, the distribution does come in 32 and 64-bit varieties, so you can use it on whatever you want there. But uh, this is just a pretty quick overview to show you guys the, uh, the latest release here. There's actually not a great deal of changes from uh, Linux Mint 18.1, but uh, all the same, it's uh, it's a fairly great great to see these guys updating these rolling releases, so to speak, as well. So uh, that's pretty much it. As you can see, I, I generally don't get into the software too much with these things. You can download pretty much what you want on Linux, but uh, they are using uh, LibreOffice as the main office environment uh, application there. If you, uh, GIMP there, there we go as well for the... Uh, the visual editor and uh, Firefox web browser as well and all their custom icons that is so uh, privy to the the Linux Mint ecosystem here. So cheers guys this is just a super quick video to show you guys a quick uh, quick look at the old Linux Mint 18.2 Sonya. Cheers have a good one.